Much of the Madison and Milwaukee soccer community is reaching out to a local family devastated by a car crash in mid-June. It happened south of Dubuque in Jackson County, Iowa. The Iowa State Patrol says 15-year-old Sarah O'Connell was driving with her learner's permit, drifted onto the shoulder, overcorrected, and rolled the family's minivan. The crash killed her parents, Joe and Ann, and injured her younger brother and sister. And News 3's Maria Guerrero has more on how family, friends, and teammates are stepping in to help. And they really are, Andy. While the loss of Joe and Ann O'Connell is still difficult to talk about, today those who played soccer and hurling with the family are remembering Joe and Ann by playing the sport they loved to help the children they leave behind. It's not competition that's bringing these players together on the field. It's a game in honor of a family that's won the hearts of many. They've got a friendly soccer game going on out here between uh, Sarah's teammates. Sarah O'Connell loves soccer. The 15-year-old played at Memorial High School and with the Madison 56ers Soccer Club. Now her teammates and friends are playing for her and her family. Great family, you know, as far as uh, soccer is concerned. Coming from Ireland, of course, it's uh, in the blood, as they say. In downtown Madison, an Irish melody helps to honor the life of Sarah's parents, Joe and Ann O'Connell. Friends and teammates pitch in to help their three children. Anybody who's a parent, um, and to think of what would happen to your children uh, if, if you are gone, I think you just, you know, we just, I felt obligated that, you know, I needed to do something just because, because I could, you know, really, it's the only reason. The money raised at this fundraiser will go to Sarah, Maeve, and Coleman, who are now living in Ireland with family members. They're beautiful kids, and they're, they were a beautiful mother and father. I mean, just storybook stuff. A family these teammates and friends in Wisconsin won't soon forget. Competition's great, but there's nothing better than people just coming out to play for the, for the love of the game, and uh, I'm sure they'd, they'd be extremely happy with something like this. Tonight, organizers are happy to report in just eight hours they raised $8,200, money that will go to the O'Connell children in Ireland. They will use these funds for medical or any other needs that come up. If you would like to help the children, donations are still accepted. They can be made out to or made out at any M&I bank under the Ann and Joe O'Connell Fund. You can tell this event just affected so many people's so lives. So many, yeah. All right, Maria, thank you very much. Okay.